Rob, somebody, it appears, may be on his way to getting kicked to the curb. Antonio Brown, I mean, my goodness. If it ain't one thing, it's another. Remember that song? I think it was Richard Dimples Fields or something like that. Yeah, but I do remember it, that. Remember that? If it ain't one thing, it's another. First, I, I'll even give you this because this is what you do. You show up to training camp in some crazy way, you know, a helicopter, a hot air balloon this time. I, I'm cool with that. It's different. You know, it, it's fun. I'm not going to jump on you for that. But you got frostbitten feet. That was the first thing. Then it was the helmet. You don't like the way the helmet looks. So you're missing practice, practices, unexcused absences from practices, apparently just over a helmet. Then there's reports that you're late to meetings. You're unfocused when you get there and finally are in the meetings. You're on your iPad looking at bank accounts and things like that. These are the reports. And now there's reports you're upset because your team rightfully fined you. They didn't find you over something subjective. They didn't find you over something you didn't do. They didn't find you over something that's in dispute. They find you because everyone knows and you know you miss practice. Unexcused absences. And now today, you know, reports that you're cursing out the general manager, Mike Mayock, and told him you were going to punch him in the face. Rob Parker, if I were the Oakland Raiders, if I were John Gruden or whoever's in charge up there, I would suspend Antonio Brown and release him today. So he is not on my roster on opening night, and he will not get the $30 million guaranteed that he was supposed to get on this contract. I am cutting him loose. He's a great player. I don't care how great he is. Because with him or without him, we're not winning the Super Bowl. So with him, maybe we win seven games. Without him, we win five, four, whatever. I don't need it. He's not that good. Pittsburgh, he was at his best. He did things no receiver had ever done, and they never won a Super Bowl. In fact, two of the years with him, they missed the playoffs. So I don't need that on my football team, and I would be giving Antonio Brown the boot. You done? I'm done. Typical overreaction prisoner of the moment. Oh, my God, he's the worst guy in the world. Imagine he got into an argument with the general manager. You need to rip his contract up because Mike Mayock is the leader of them all. He gets everything right. You can't go against Mike Mayock. Oh, my God, what has Mike Mayock won? Oh, at what Super Bowl has Mike Mayock won? Go look at his draft his draft of boards over the last five or six years of the NFL draft. You would ask yourself, how the hell did he ever get a job as a general manager? That's how bad it was. It's about whether the guy can play. They married him alcoholic. They can't be shocked that he wants booze on the way home. I hate to break it to you. The Raiders knew what they got in bed with. Yes. This is who he is. You can't ask him to change. This is who he is. But you know what else he is? He's a hell of a receiver. You mentioned it. Nobody in the NFL put up the numbers that this guy has. And when you have talent, you know what you do? You put up with BS. Short. You put up with BS. That's what you do. If he couldn't play, if I'm the Raiders, you know what I do? Short I man. put him out there. I let him play. If he can't play, then I'll get rid of him. If Short he gets me three touchdowns in a game, I'm good to go. Everybody's not a choir boy. Everybody's Short not man. the same. Stop it <laughs> with this whole idea. And your menu thing, enough already. My menu thing? My menu thing? It is about what wins and losses. What did your favorite say? You know for two things. One, 
No way, no how. Or is it the no That's how, right. No way, no, way, no and how. Two, I am paying for that. Short menu. Wins and losses. How many Super Bowls has Antonio Brown won? You know it's bigger than that. It's not just on the on the wide receiver. So you can't even judge it on that. Why wide receivers precisely wide receivers don't even have right. you don't I, even you I do agree. not you do not I even agree. count that's why I you don't, don't even count rings when it comes to wide receivers. No how many rings did Jerry uh, Rice win? Nobody two. even knows. Two. Nobody. I believe two. But if you, not you're three. guessing. You no, don't no, he's know. Won at least two. But you don't know, and that's my point. You don't no, know. But that, okay, but you that, don't you know. Just you just proved no. You proved my Antonio point. Antonio Brown we don't is count not it. going to make or break my team, but so I can get rid of him. Chris, he you makes you better. Maybe stop really? it. Yes, better than what? He makes you better, better than, than you were a year ago. Like yes, six. he makes you better, and that's what it's about. It's about it's talent. It's about a short menu, stop, Mr. Parker. Stop you with know the it. stop with the PC police, and everybody's got to be. Prim and proper. People have problems I, I, all the I time. Like I want Ezekiel Elliott. Reg- we, Ezekiel Elliott's not prim and proper. Reggie Jackson and Billy Martin had a fight in the dugout with the Yankees. You know what they did? They still won a World Series. There have been teams that fought and had problems and all kinds of stuff. They couldn't stand each other. And they still won. So stop with all this, all this I other have stuff. I never said you need to be a choir boy. Nobody, this whole but, is but a total overreaction. You need to be about team. Reggie Jackson, was he not about the team? Did he have a fight with his manager in the dugout during I, the game? I, you know what? Yes bro? or no? I had a yes big or no. argument with my basketball coach in college, so it happens. But this is they should have cut you off the team. Fight. Why didn't they cut you off the team? You're a malcontent. You're a distraction. You ruined everybody in Division Three basketball with your antics. You know why? Because it didn't go on for the entire month or two of training camp. You shouldn't have done it at all. You should have repented. You should have been a nice man. This is ridiculous, Rob. Because here's the thing. You're right. I'm not saying Mike Mayock is anything special. The fact of the matter is, I'm going to ask you a question. All of the things Antonio Brown has done during this training camp, is he right or is he wrong? Of course he's wrong, but that's not the reason to cut he's a guy. He's not that. He not is. Good. It, he, you, here, here's why he I would is cut what him, he I is. I don't want to give him. At this point, I don't want to give him the thirty million dollars. He's not worth it because even with him, we're not going to be that good. I'm. I mean, I, I get it. You're right. He's a great player. We would be better if we're the Raiders with him. But he's not worth this. He said in a bad example for the other young players. You pick Josh Jacobs to be the offensive rookie of the year, they're running back. What is Josh Jacobs learning from Antonio Brown? All he needs to do is... if I do it on the field, I can get away with all this madness? All he needs to do is do what he knows and live his life and do what's right for him. You can't look to other people. No, nah, sometimes it ain't you can't just look to other about people. what's right for there you. Are also, it's about what's right, There's period. also There are also, but just an overreaction, Chris. It's not overreaction. It is. He had, what did he do? He, he had an uh, argument. Really? No, no, no. He should be cut no, for no. an argument? No, no. Is he the first guy that ever looked on their iPad or fell asleep? Parker, I can give you a list. Why? I can You're give you a list of great players. No, I'm not. You just say it's an argument. What? It's not just an argument. It was argument. an argument. It's frostbitten feet. It's the helmet they foolishness. They didn't suspend him for it's any of that. It's for meetings. It's That's not what they suspended meetings. him for, Chris. If they would have suspended him for being late for a meeting or for the feet, then you'd have a point. You're telling me now because he argued with Mike Mayock it's the end of the world? That's no. the last straw? Well, That's the last it. straw for you? It's track Mike record. Mayock? Please. It's track record. This is not the one thing. If this was the only thing, they, it wouldn't even be a story. You knew it when you signed up with him, okay, what he, what he brings to the table. Example. You got your little example. You marry an alcoholic. <laughs> you know what you got. You know what? If I marry an alcoholic, it doesn't mean her alcoholism couldn't drive me crazy. <laughs> and at some point, I'm like, damn it, it's time for a divorce. <laughs> wow. I'm serious. This is ridiculous. Antonio Brown needs to grow up. And I ain't playing with it. If I'm running the Raiders, I don't want him. Period. Did you hear the soundbite from uh, John Gruden? John, yeah. Did you, he's, 
Can He's we play been playing it? both sides of the what fence is, for the last this, three this weeks? To me, this to me doesn't sound like somebody who's ready to cut bait. Let's Obviously, hear Obviously, you've been at training camp, I think, for the last four weeks. We have been practicing without him and preparing to play. Uh, no matter who's injured, you have to adapt. Unfortunately, we had to adapt again today, but we're really excited about our receiving core. I'm emotional about it. I hope you, hope you understand why. I think a lot of this guy. I think Antonio is a great receiver. And I think deep down, I think he's a really good guy. So I'm, I'm frustrated. I'm not going to say any more about it. Hope it all works out. There it is. They're playing good cop, bad He's cop. frustrated. So no, but he's frustrated. He and I, and frustrated. He does. It's ridiculous. And I think his point is well taken that deep down, this guy, he has some he issues. He might be, but Chris, if he, okay, he has I ain't got to deal you, with your issues. Would you got to agree? Does he have some yeah, issues? Yeah, he got okay. issues. And you he, know what? Has, go, go figure them out. Not he, on my dime. He has, I'm not paying you $30 million to work out your issues he, on my football he team. He has issues, but damn, is he a good receiver. Are they going to win anything oh with him? Oh, my goodness. Are they going to win anything with him? All what I know they is they'll win, win more games than they won't without So them. what? So they win eight instead of five. If you're a Yippee. paying customer, it might be a big difference. That's, that might be a game that nice. you went to see. Nobody even knows where their games are being played at. What are you talking about? They're being played in Oakland. The fans ain't going to those games. You know that. They need to, it, Look, if he wasn't making a ton of money, I, I, I mean, might be all right with it. Although it's, it's jacking up my locker room, too. It's setting a bad example for the youngsters. Let's see what the callers think, Rob. 877-99 on Fox. Let's do uh, Jerry in Kentucky. You're on the Odd Couple, Fox Sports Radio. What you got? Hey, guys. I, I watch. I listen to y'all every night. I talked to y'all yesterday. Hey, Chris, man, what is wrong, man? You 0 for 2 two days in a row. Yeah. Bro. Man, there's no way. There's no way you get rid of Antonio Why Brown. Not? There's no way you Is he him. worth $30 you know, million? He dollars. Is, he is, he has not won. An, okay, I will give you this much. He has not won uh, an NFL a Super Bowl yet. But not that even man been is a, that that man is a dog, and he is a very good football player for your team. Now he might be going through some other crazy mess in his head right now. He might be thinking he's bigger than life, and I believe they do have a right to find him, get him right. Yep. But you do not cut him. You do not sit him down. And the one thing you don't do is you don't tell him, hey, man, you're not worth being on this team. There is no way, because I appreciate this much, there would be a lot of other teams that would be wanting that cat. Now, they you know might, what? They Hold might on. You know there what? Were, teams, and, weren't, and, teams weren't and, knocking and, down and the Jerry, Steelers' you know door. And, Jerry, you know where he could wind up? He could wind up right in New England with Tom Brady and the Patriots. You watch Jerry, and see. Jerry, were teams beating down the Steelers' door? They traded him for a third and a fifth rounder. Yeah, Nobody they, they, was they, offering they, a ton for him. And well, they ate twenty. It's, they hold on, and they ate twenty one million dollars. They ate twenty one million dollars to get rid of him. Bye, Felicia. Well, we'll see. I'm sorry, and I'm with you. He is awesome. I, both you guys, Jerry, Rob, he's awesome. His numbers, I'm just saying, his numbers are unmatched. When people just, I'm not like if people don't know about a B like on the field seriously, like you hear all the stories. Just go look at the numbers, Chris. You know but that he's we talk not, about, he, no, he's no, great, I know, but he's not talk about it. that. But a lot of people, a lot of people don't understand that. I really don't think people know and, how good. The he reason is. I would cut him, I get what you guys are saying. Give it a try. Let him play a few games. The reason I was cutting him is because if I suspend him and release him now, I'm I'm free from the whole fifty million, thirty million dollars guaranteed. That's what. That's why I would do it. Because right. I don't think, as good as he is, he's not bringing that much value to my team, in my view. Mr. Willie in uh, Georgia, you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What you got? Hey, what's up, hey, what's up fellas? I love you. I started listening to y'all about a month ago, man. Listen here, um, uh, Rob, I used to agree with you. But you're wrong tonight, boy. My boy Chris is right. I would cut him so fast, make his head swim. He ain't worth the headache, man. Yes, yeah, a headache. He's it's not a headache. worth the headache. It, I'm the, saying hey, Mr. Willie. all that stuff. Yes. What are, are the Raiders better with him or worse? I'm just asking that. I don't care. I'd rather be worse than him without I'd rather be worse. I wouldn't put up with him. First of all, I wouldn't even put up with him. I'd cut him. I'd much rather, I'd much rather go 0 and 16 than have guys that hustle and have a knuck and see at the problem. He's gotten away with it for so long till now he thinks somebody want to do so. Now I agree, Mike may, I may not be the best, but hey. I'm not Chris. I cut him so fast and make his head swim. I wouldn't even care. All like, right. Appreciate I the call. I just want to get off that money. No, That's I, my I, main thing. Yeah, your, your motivation is the money. Yeah. Uh, all right. Nick in Kentucky, you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What's up, Nick? What's up, guys? They don't cut A.B. A.B. retires a Raider. 
He what? I, okay, so so well, how do you think this is going to play out? That he's going to – everything's going to end up hunky-dory? I mean, well, Mike Madoff, whatever his name is. Mike he's Mayock. Like the guy at a- Mayock. He's like the guy – he's the HR guy at your work that <laughs> nobody likes. No, no big I, deal. I, this is not about Mike a game. Mayock. And, and to me, it's not well, about apparently Mayock. Well, it was, but anyway, no, he gets suspended no. a game. He gets suspended a game. That's it. Nah, I, I don't need him. Maybe if we were on the cusp of a Super Bowl, I'd try to put up with it, but nah. Can we squeeze one more in? Matt in California, you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. What's up, Matt? Hey, guys. How you doing? Doing great. What's up, man? Right on. I, uh, great show. Love you guys. I just got to say, Rob, I feel you're wrong about this, man. I, the Raiders have this get-out-of-jail-free card they got to take advantage of. Right. Get rid of the headache. Get rid of the trends this guy is. But he the— just, my only issue with my only issue is the Raiders. Their their whole uh, 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 franchise is about renegades and about trouble and about guys who aren't uh, choir boys. Isn't that what the Raiders uh, are are about? They, they he fits the Raiders. That's why they got Randy Moss. That's why they got Randy all Moss kinds of was guys. Bad there. No, but that's why they went and picked them up. That that's what the Raiders have always but done. But you, I get that. And again, I, look, I love Ezekiel Elliott. He's done. I mean, as far as off the field, he's been alleged to have done worse things than Antonio Brown. No doubt about it. So I'm not saying everybody's got to be a choir boy, I, but I do think you got to be about the team. You got to be about the team, and I don't think Anton. I think he's just, in my view. He's showing he's not about the team. That's what he's showing to me. So that's my view. But good good to hear from the callers on that. I like it. Uh, it was mixed, too. It yep, wasn't one-sided. Yep. It was all yep. over the place. Good stuff, it's guys. Offensive lineman in the NFL, now a Fox Sports Radio weekend host. It's our man Ephraim Salam. Ephraim, what's happening? What's up? What's going on? We great, man. We great. Rob and I were just discussing <laughs> Antonio Brown. And you know, you know better than us what it's like to be in an NFL locker room. My take, Ephraim, is that they should suspend Antonio and release him because that way, mainly, the main thing is they can get off that $30 million guaranteed. Like, this is your chance to wash your hands of AB. You tried. It's been a disaster. Move on. Rob thinks you should keep him because he's so good. What's your view? Uh, I'm with you, Chris. You know, the, 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 and, and, and I'll explain why. Because he just got there, right? So he's already had a past of being disruptive to the team in the locker room with the Facebook Live stuff and, and, and just habitually overstepping the line. And I'm not talking about stuff off the field. I'm talking about stuff that directly affects your locker room. Right. The guys in the locker room. Watching hard knock this uh, this season with the Oakland Raiders, it put it, it lets you know exactly who Antonio Brown is and what's important to him. It's all about him. It's all about him, the helmet, what he's doing. Everybody loves AB. AB loves, like, even the way he was greeting his teammates, it was more about him than him being with that team. And when you look at him, when he posted that, uh, yesterday, that fine letter, you you damn right you got fined. If you decided right. you don't want to come to something mandatory, that's not an A-B thing. That's a league thing, right? That's not a we're picking on you. That's a you disrespected the team. If you miss a plane or you miss a meeting or you miss a, a, a practice, it costs money. Like, that's that, 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 that wasn't made for him. That's league-wide. And why would you put that – on social media and, and, and make it seem like every, everybody hating on you. What? We all watch that soap opera. I'm telling you this. He just got there. He has done nothing, nothing whatsoever to help your team. Have they played any games, Ephraim, yet? Have they no, they haven't game? played any games. Has he hurt them while winning games yet? Yeah, you know why? Ephraim. Because he's unreliable. So let, me, let me ask you this. Is, they, is, it, is this new to you? Seriously? You think the Raiders didn't know who they signed when they got in bed with him? You they, know what? At, what? This, that, at this that, level? I can't buy it. They knew. They already yeah, they knew. knew. Okay, but you got to understand. Now, guess what's going to happen in the middle of the season when he's not getting all the targets? 
when they're rolling the coverage over to but him. But they and he's knew that teams. before they so before this. They yeah, already at, knew. At point, you can't that act Rob, like it. That okay, let me ask they you this. Can't admit we made a mistake. Thank you, thank you, Rob. I mean, let me ask you this, Rob. Let me ask you this. All right, say you meet a girl, right? You at the bar, you man, she bad. She this, she that, she this and she that. She, you know, she fly. All of that, you know, everything right. you're looking for. And your man, your boy, say, yo, look, yo, man, you you don't want that. All right, I know her. She a headache. Trust me, she gonna mess your life up. You like, you know what? I'm just gonna roll the dice, man. I'm going, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take her out, right? And you take her out, and at first it's nice and all of that. And next thing you know, she's standing in your driveway with a flashlight, looking in your windows, <laughs> and right? Do you break up with her, or do you like, ah, uh, you know, she's still fine? No, I'm, I'm just going. I knew, that I knew what I was getting into. That's a great example. I, I just, I'm for real. I, like you gonna be, at, at a certain point, you're gonna be like, all right, you look. My homeboy tried to warn me. That's my bad, baby. Crazy. I got to get up out of here. I just, I just think that, I think people. It's just Mike Mayock. All of a sudden, having an argument with it. I'm sure he's the first player had an argument with, do that. with a general manager. Yes, he can. You uh, can't, on the field. Yes, he can have an argument no, with can't. a GM. Bruh, bruh, a, you can't do it's that. It's never happened Trust before. It's never happened you before. You can't do that. That's not. Look, man. This is a business. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. With all of what what guys have done in the NFL, they've done all kinds of stuff, felony stuff. They could do that, but still play. And a guy had an argument. He needs to be cut immediately. You don't even sound you know, right. Rob, it's from. not just because of the argument. Right. You know it that. has nothing Come about on. to do. What What are you talking about? Felonies and all. I'm, I'm, talking, not, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about. I'm not talking about none of that. I'm talking about Look, all the other stuff that guys have done, and for Look, some reason they get to play football, and a guy has an argument or falls asleep in a, in a, in a meeting, and all of a sudden he can't play football. It's That's not ridiculous. about that. Right. It's ridiculous. It's not about that. You, ridiculous. You, you talking about two different things, man. If you break the law, that's one thing. No, but right? they There's bring guys process. back. Listen, hold on, man. It's due process to that. So there, there are certain guidelines and rules in place for that. Once you re, uh, once you uh, do everything and complete those guidelines, you can come back and play. Right? So guys aren't create, uh, committing crimes and then playing the next game. No, but right? my it's point is that, that, but that well, yes, just, but my point is that those guys get to come back to Rob, play. Nobody and you're telling me that Antonio should be, be he should be cut immediately no, because no, he no, got into an argument no, with Mike all, Mayock. Oh my all, God! It's the it, end Rob. of the world. What about the frostbite? What about the helmet Frostbite, too. What oh, about that's late terrible. To meetings, all that? I mean, seriously. Hey, and, no, psycho he girl. He he from, when psycho you, girl. When psycho you, girlfriend sitting in the backseat of your car when you wake up and get in the car and go to work. Talking about, hey, baby, I missed you. What you going to do? I would, Antonio I would, Brown I would stop is a psycho by girlfriend. And get her a sausage biscuit and a cup of coffee? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> all right. We're joined right. by Ephraim Salam, former NFL offensive lineman, Fox Sports Radio weekend host. All right, Ephraim, tonight we got the Packers and the and the Bears. But you were right on uh, AB too. Thank you for that honest opinion. No problem. Um, it, and it's well just enlightened the truth. opinion. Yeah, it's just the truth. You guys um, keep stroking each other. Go ahead. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> these are two teams that you know. Rob and I both have them. Both we got you got the Bears in the playoffs, right, Rob? I think we both have yes. them in the playoffs. What's your outlook for both of these teams? I like the Bears. Um, defensively, even if they're not as great as they were last year, even if they don't lead the league in, in takeaway, I still think they're going to be formidable. Uh, we, we we saw firsthand the, the same rule with a Peggy there. Uh-oh. Right? I don't see them taking the backwards. All right, we, 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 we're losing you. You got me? All right, go Uh-oh. ahead. Yeah, you that's me? better. Go ahead. Yeah, that's better. I would, I would say just with their defense, even if they're, they're, they're not a, a, as good as they were last year and lead the league in, in takeaways and all of that, they're still going to be formidable. The growth Mitchell Trubisky showed last year under Matt Nagy is, is tremendous. I think they have a good opportunity to win that division. I think it's out of them in Minnesota. I don't know what to expect out of Aaron Rodgers in Green Bay. I don't know if this is the greatest thrower of the football like people like to proclaim the greatest – you know, quarterback to ever play. Show me something, bro. I'm tired mm. of hearing that. I, I mm. need, I need something. Like serious. I, I really need some. 
talking about, oh, I don't you have need the weapons. More, you, need more than, you need more than two MVPs and, and uh, the most uh, uh, completions without yes. an interception and the highest yes. quarterback rating in the history of the yep. NFL uh, b- yep. b- of any other quarterback or the best yep. touchdown to interception ratio. Come on, yes. Ethan. About don't act like he hasn't right. played or hasn't done anything. <laughs> Bruh. Stop. Bruh, look, you so you really emotional today, man. Yeah, Did I, I hear home on that, on, that, on that crazy show? <laughs> it, don't make, it, don't make, it don't make sense. <laughs> It does make sense. Look, Show when you talk about something. elite court, listen, listen. <laughs> when you talk about when you talk about elite quarterback, do you know what the one caveat for me for an elite quarterback is? If you take him off a team and put him on any other team, they're a playoff team. That's an elite quarterback. Aaron Rodgers is not a play. They're not even a playoff team with him on there. That's what I'm talking about. You got the, look, man. I don't care what's going on in your personal life. I don't care what receivers you do or don't have, the running game, you got to show up and show out, period. Tom Brady's been doing it with less than and a you stellar. Tell me, and you just, you just banged the drum about Mitch Trubisky? Is that what you're telling me? Come on, no, man. No, what I'm telling you is – I take you seriously they, when you're going to – You just made the big thing about Mitch Trubisky, and, and, and they're telling me that Aaron Rodgers doesn't make that the Packers a playoff team? Really? Did, they, did the Packers make the playoffs last year? I, I'm sorry, Chris. Chris no, I'm sorry. they didn't. Did I'm asking you. Did You're I miss something? You're telling me they're not a playoff one. team with Aaron Rodgers. Did I miss, did I miss something? Did I miss something last year? Before he got I'm hurt sorry. the last couple of years, they I won eight hey, straight. Here we they go. won here eight we go division with the hurt. titles. Here we go with the hurt. He was hurt. Hey, guess what? Show he played up. 15 okay? games. Okay, yeah. be available. Be available. That's all I'm saying. If, if, if he's the greatest thrower of the football – they throw the football. What were we talking about? Ephraim coming with heat tonight, man. We love it. Rack great em. stuff. Great stuff. Don't brother, rack tonight. that. Stop it. No, you had some great Erase opinions. Erase that. Some strong opinions. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we appreciate it, brother. Thank you. Enjoy of the course, game man. tonight. Get off All the right. line. Get off the line. I'm tired of Ephraim tonight. <laughs>